We've got a lotus in here that's hit a tree, unfortunately. A mate of mine from Darwin has bought it from an auction. We never realised it was as bad as what it probably is. But it'll give us um, something to pull apart, see the majority of the damage once it's apart and what we can do. This thing has had a little bit more work done on it today. It's had um, all the back floors welded back into it. Cut the fuel flap fill her out because we won't be filling it from that point. We decided to put an electric motor in it, so mm. we've got to get rid of the fuel tank. Just a few more rust repairs around the show. Mm. Mm. say things have got to look worse before they look better. I hope that saying's correct. It's usually this point in a build you start to lose motivation because you think everything you've done was starting to look good and then you fucked it by pulling it all out. Pulling more off the car. So the car is 100 million pieces now. It's the worst of all the most amount of pieces it's ever been. But we're getting it ready to go and get painted. It's going out to Toowoomba. And then when it comes back, we can get into putting the motor and everything back in for good, hopefully. So this is the shit part. I do not like this part, but someone's got to do it. We got Charlie on the TIG welding up some pipes. It looks better than the welds that come on the intercooler. I'm inside an engine bay. Fucking yay. All primed. I'm glad that's over. The painter can do the rest. Cheers to project cars, they said. <laughs>